and welcome to part 3 of this awesome tension filled and whatnot custom story. We are now going to find out if Shadow has been possessed by demons or as you can remember the virus. And so what I gotta do is that I'm gonna, I'm gonna use this uh, meat place it into his, you know, corral and so he can eat and by that I'll get a lot of you know, spit and god knows on that bone and I can just by looking at it, take some samples and analyze it and we can get a step closer to finding who the hell is trolling me is it that leg again? Alright, how is this even possible? I... you saw it all in part 2, I threw it him like a mile away from here and... No, he still had to return. Uh, I was going to shadow. I almost forgot. So, you know... Once again... I should be... Are you kidding me? Oh my god! There we go, just be nice when I'm trying to leave this place. If not... I'll threaten you with fire. Would you just please... Oh, there we go. Run! I should go to a safe distance and wait. I should run to a safe distance and wait. Is it a door or is it a dog? Well, I think it's Shadow. Sounds like a door, a rusty door opening. Well, are you going to eat? Well, I can barely see. Oh, don't look at the enemy. Because then it gets insane and then I get insane. And okay. I took the hint. I took the hint. Yes, I was looking at it. We don't want a mess. Neither do I. Are you done yet? Have you... Have you left the corral? Are you done? No, no, no. no. It's still there, it's still there. Yes, it's still there. Just come on. I think he has finished this meal. He just doesn't. Well, actually, in fact, he did. I wonder where he's hiding. Pick up the remains. Oh, Shadow! I got something for you. Well, that's a lot of piss. Try to avoid that. Ah, whoa, I'm feeling sick. What the hell is going on? What the hell? Is there something? I don't think it is. Ah, whatever. What is this? What is this? Sanity? Are you kidding me? It's just a room. And a candle and... Whatever. Apple cider. I feel much better. I guess the whole room smells of urine or some dog feces, I don't know. Maybe that's what's making me dizzy. Fine. I'll do it. Now I'm getting less insane. That's good to know. third time don't know how many times I gotta go here but certainly it's not the last talking about sinking the loading screen was done when I needed it to be oh 
opening the lab for the third time, I guess. Oh my god. Remains. Hang on a second. Alright, what the hell is going on? Is this supposed to be harder than finding the F13 key on my keyboard? If so, then tell me. No mementos. What? What is this? What is this? What is going on? Alright, alright. Are you kidding me? Finish the dancing. I am going to grab it. I can continue dancing. What is this? Seriously, what is this? Just adrenaline. What is this? Honestly. Alright. Lost and confused, don't know what to do. This reminds me of a Zelda puzzle. I think it's glitched or something. Doesn't tell me what to do. I simply don't know what's going on. It should work. I have done the mission. There's no more missions to do. And the bone just won't enter the cabinet. And then I can't continue my experiment. That is really unfortunate. And of course, wherever I look, there is no clue, there's nothing telling me how to proceed, and there's no hints or help at all. Fine. This was unexpected. Alright, it seems that I gotta cut it here, because I just gotta find out what's, what's going on. I, I think I should just uh, search around the area, look for some notes or whatever I can find. Maybe then I can proceed with the story, so I'll get back to them. Let's try this way instead. Just a little reminder, please put us on tampons, this grass, its nest, and the whole floor is covered in blood. Thank you. Holy f... Okay. Yeah, they are infected. Well, would you look at that? Holy... Sorry, I thought I was getting pulled towards the closet. Out of my way. <laughs> okay. Well. Tinderbox. What is going on? It's not especially dark in there, it's actually pretty bright. Signs of a new plague. The new plague. It's the title, by the way. Signs of a new plague has appeared in Boston, where people seem to suffer by everything from skin infections to dying organs. More than 50 people have already been reported dead, and at least 200 people are badly ill. The infection seems to not only affect humans, but also affect animals. Some appear to be extremely aggressive, while some others are simply acting very strangely, making the disease very unpredictable. It's still unknown if the infection is spreading in the air, blood, skin contact, or other ways. It's recommended to stay inside at all time and report to the nearest quarantine zone if signs of the infection are shown. The Boston newspaper. The article perfectly describes shadow my film and every other infected animals around there. Holy! Just use the doorbell next time. Ah, that's... Right, they don't have a doorbell. I got a hammer. Run, 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 run.
are you? What is this? I got the bone. Do I have to mix something? Let's head back to the lab again. It is definitely a bug around there. Definitely. Not right. Anything in here? No. Why do I need a hammer? Why do I need a hammer? Why won't you work? So now we're working. Infected saliva. Seems like the same virus, so both animals and humans are infected by the same disease. Not sure if it helps, but uh, I can try to mix the infected blood with some calamine. It's good for diseases, uh, whatever. Got it right here. What? How about... There we go. Crap, did not help at all. Talk about a strong virus. I want to try something else, if I can find something strong like acid, toxin, or something like that. Talking about mom's cooking eyes, I assume? So, that's it for today, and stay tuned for the next part. So, uh, we're going to mix this little thing with uh, acid. See you later.